Um, last week and this week, we've been learning all about the ocean and ocean animals. And today, I wanted to um, read a book about sea turtles. So today, we're going to talk and learn all about sea turtles. Um, so this book here is by National Geographic Kids. It is a level two. And it's by Laura Marsh. You see the sea turtle there? So I want you guys to think all about um, what you all know about sea turtles and if you've ever seen one before. So here we go. Sea turtles. Look at this one right here. I think this one's a really good picture of a sea turtle there. So sea turtles. And there's your table of contents. If you like to jump ahead on this and learn about something specific, this is the page you're gonna look at. A sea turtle. What hatches on land but spends its life in the sea? What starts out the size of a ping pong ball but can grow up to seven feet long? What do you think it is, friends? It's a sea turtle. Look how beautiful it looks. Ocean world. Sea turtles are graceful swimmers in the water. Their flippers move like wings. And sea turtles travel the world in warm ocean waters. They are one of the few reptiles that live in the sea. So right here is a map where it's dark blue here is where the sea turtles travel. So right here on the Atlantic, Indian, Pacific Ocean. A sleek body helps the turtle move easily through the water. So here you have a green sea turtle. We're going to read a few of these bubbles to tell us more about this. A sea turtle has lungs because it breathes air. A sea turtle holds its breath underwater. So kind of like us, when we go underwater, we hold our breath and then we breathe when we come back up. It says sea turtles can't pull their heads and limbs into their shell like land turtles do. So right here, you see they, they can't move their head inside their shell, like we've seen some turtles do. Their large, powerful flippers act like paddles. And their back flippers steer the turtle as it swims. And they also use, um, are used to dig nests in the sand. So whenever they want to lay their eggs, it's their back flippers that help them. Let's meet the turtles. The loggerhead is the most common sea turtle in the southeastern United States. It gets its name from its large head. Then you have the flatback. Do you think it has a curved body if it's called a flatback? Mm, let's see. The flatback has a flat body. It's the only sea turtle that doesn't live in U.S. waters. It lives in Australia. And here you have the olive. Ridley has an olive colored shell and it's shaped like a heart. There it is. Look how beautiful it is. Ooh, here's some more. You have the hawk's bill can't dive deep and it spends most of its time on the water surface. And then you have the green turtle has a small head. Unlike other sea turtles, it goes ashore to warm itself up, up, up in the sun. There he is. Now you might be thinking this one looks a bit different. It is. So this is an endangered turtle. It's at risk of dying now. And it's called the leatherback. It doesn't have a hard shell, but its skin is rubbery with small bones underneath. Do you see how it looks kind of different than this one up here and even that one up here? And then you have this one right there. That's a Kemp's Ridley. Ooh, this one is also an endangered sea turtle. I think they have tons of turtle hospitals with those types of turtles. Nest building. A female sea turtle comes on land to lay her eggs. She usually returns to the same beach where she's, where she's ha where she hatched. Scientists aren't sure
sure how sea turtles know where to go. They think it's um, the sea turtles know by instinct. They just know. The instinct is a behavior that animals are born knowing how to do. So you see the sea turtle digs a hole with her back flippers. She lays her eggs and covers them with sand. Then she returns to the sea. See right here, she, this is a sand going up because she's digging with her back flippers. Oh baby, crack, the egg hatched hatches after 50 to 70 days. Tiny turtles called hatchlings crawl out of their eggshells. And there it is, it's a hatchling. It's a young animal that has just come out of its egg. And they are less than three inches long. So you see that? That's about the size of a little hatchling. Hatchlings usually crawl toward the sea at night. In the dark, they are hidden from predators. The little turtles follow the brightest light. The line where the sky meets the sea is the brightest natural light on the beach. If the hatchlings follow the light, they will make it out to the sea. So you see how it's going toward the light there. And right there is the sea. Then you have big and small. 